may speak with the tongue of men and angels, but have not love, I have become a sounding brass or a clanging cymbal. And though I have the gift of prophecy and understand all the mysteries and the knowledge, though I have faith so that I could remove mountains, but I have not love, I am nothing. And although I bestow all my goods to feed the poor, and though I give my body to be burned, but have not love, it profits me nothing. If I leave a light on, will you know it burns bright for you? Coming over late night, tired eyes that stay up with you. It was incredible that he had found someone that, that he loves more than football. Which is true. He's missing the game right now to be here. And that's all he's thinking about. <laughs> if you ask me to... We love Chelsea like another daughter. We're so glad that she's joining the Duncan family. We've waited for a long time for that last part. And it's here. And we thank you. You're not crying. You're going to make me cry. <laughs> you keep crying in their water. You look beautiful. I don't know if I'm supposed to kiss you, but I wanted to. It's okay. My eyes are watering. <laughs> We're just really happy that you guys ended up together and that it's 20, well, I guess at that time, 2015 and the internet's around for y'all to have met. <laughs> <laughs> Whether we're here once a year, 10 times a year, I don't know. We want to get up here. We love you guys. We hide broken beliefs and the next journey is going to be really good. You just have to remember, you know, you guys are still going to probably go through some tough times, but love will see you through. You guys have made it through a lot, so. will fight demons, defeat enemies, build a life, and forge a bond that is greater than the sum of all parts. With these public promises and vows and the exchange of wedding bands, I now pronounce you by the power vested in me, husband and wife. Will the audience please stand and welcome Mr. and Mrs. Bryce Duncan. It only makes sense for Bryce to be an Iowa and to be an Iowan. <laughs> but thank, thank goodness he's an Iowa State boy. Those Hawkeyes, they'll come around someday. Ha!